Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to the channel. Today on Roblox Spring, we'll be looking at a rather interesting topic. We'll be looking at your favorite Roblox YouTubers who made Roblox games. If you know of any of these, then be sure to let us know in the comments section below. So without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Alrighty, the first YouTuber who made a Roblox game on this list is Poke. Now Poke decided to make a Roblox game to catch haters. I find this a little funny because I mean, it is kind of creative of him and a hater is a hater. So if they fall for something like this, then I guess they deserve it. The game he created was basically like a game where you jump into a hole. Poke decided to put signs up that say stuff like, jump into this hole if you hate Poke. And then when they get to the very end of the hole, there's a sign saying, say hi, you are on YouTube. This is basically like a prank on his haters. And he actually says that it is a fake game. But yeah, I find it pretty cool that he did this because it just teaches them not to get involved with him if they don't like him. Don't spread hate guys. Also, after he created the game, he made a fake account to see how many people would actually fall for it. There were quite a few of them. But take a look at the clips of how it went. People were literally just spawning in, then jumping straight into the hole. Not even kidding, a few minutes. This is so funny, bro. It's I'm not even kidding, it's been a few minutes and the advertisement is already going to a lot of people. Like the fact that said to get 8 million impressions is so funny, but look at all these people going, jump down at you, hey, Poke. Oh my goodness, this is so funny, bro, because then you jump down. Now, I'm gonna ask in the chat, I'm gonna say, who else hates Poke like me? I hate Poke. He is so ugly. Next up, we have Dennis. Now, a few of you may know about this one, but he did create a Roblox game, so let's check it out. It was released last year, and it's called Superhero Simulator. For those of you who have played this game, then be sure to let us know what you think about the game and why in the comments section below. For those of you who have not played this game, then I highly suggest that you check it out, because who doesn't love Dennis? I mean, he was voted best Roblox YouTuber in this year's Bloxy Awards. Anyways, the description of the game is criminals and villains have escaped onto the streets of Roblox City. Fight as your favorite superheroes in Superhero Simulator. One of the great things about this game is that you start off with a thousand free coins. And then he did this thing where if you use his name Dennis as a code, you will get an additional amount of 4,000 free coins. How awesome is that? If you know the game, then you know that it has a lot of cool items in it and amazing avatars. Next, we have one that has recently just got announced at the annual Bloxy Awards. And if you watch the Bloxy Awards and you know who it was. Yup, Leah Ash. She announced her debut game that she has been working on, and it's a capture the flag. But she said instead of a flag, it will be a sandwich. As she is talking about it, you can see Jay Party trying to capture the sandwich. Here's what she had to say. Oh hey guys, I was just working on my debut Roblox game. It's like capture the flag, except the flag's a sandwich. Now we have a game from Inquisitor Master. So Alex and her friends made a game that was Roblox's Got Talent. And it's quite creative because it also makes them interact with their fans. Basically, they teleport fans into the game onto the stage and ask them what their talent is, if they have one. They are also judges. And with any other show like this, they eventually have to come down to a winner. All I can say is it was pretty interesting because they were savages, but they were having fun. And I guess that's all that matters, right? If you guys participated in this, then be sure to let us know in the comments section below. They got a lot of interesting people performing in this contest. There was this one interesting person whose name is Harley, and she said she can sing, and well, her song was a hit for the judges. Last but not least, we have a game from Megan Plays. This game is called Robloxia World. She also has a code of her name that you can put in the shop that gives you an awesome gift from her. She seems very excited about this, and well, she is on top of things with it because she does update it on every Friday. She also made it a free to play game, which is also great because it gives everyone access to it and they can enjoy it. She also talks about how much effort she and her team put into the game, and it is actually a fun game, so I suggest that you guys check it out because it is quality. If you have already checked it out, then let us know in the comments what you think her game was like. So if you guys know of any other amazing Roblox YouTubers that have created cool games, then let us all know in the comments section below too, so we can also check them out. Unfortunately, that is all we have for you today. I hope you guys found this video interesting or fun, so if you enjoyed it, then be sure to give it a massive thumbs up. Also, for our fellow newcomers, if you like this video and want to see more content like this, then be sure to check out our previous video and to hit that subscribe button for more upcoming content. Thank you for watching. See you all next time on Roblox Spring.